Amen. Once again, please, can you help me say, Happy birthday to Papa. Daddy, we love you so much. On behalf of your biological children and uh, the entire members of Omega Fire Ministries worldwide, we are saying a happy, happy, happy birthday. Hallelujah. We are so happy for the gift of you. We are so grateful to God. Amen. And um, I, don't, I really don't know where to start from. But let me just, let me just, let me start from anywhere. <laughs> Praise God. My prayer today for you only is that God will continue to make you and help you, use you to be, continue to be a global voice for this generation. You know, while I was sitting down there, I overheard Papa. Say to Reverend Fidelis, please, time, 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 time. Ah, it's amazing. That is passion for kingdom investment. is something else. Sometimes I get very scared. Ah. You know, I begin to ask myself, this man, he knew this sleep. Everything about my husband's life is just how to keep affecting lives. How to keep affecting lives. As, see, let me say this to you. In case you, as Papa is sitting right there, everything, if we, if we give him, Reverend said, Papa, is your day. But Papa is just too eager to leave that seat. I want to move. Always on the move. Always on the move. Always on the move. Ha. 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 He would tell you. He was just looking at my face. Ha. Ah, time. Time. Because you know he has a program in Togo. He wants to. Even when they were, when they were saying, oh, Papa, happy birthday. My husband was just, my husband, the face is just changing. Only time. Time. Togo program. Togo. Togo program. Togo. And I looked at him. I said, change this expression. Change it. Change it. Change it. Change it, change it. Don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. Don't worry, we'll work with time. Reverend Fidelis said, Daddy, it's your day. Now, what am I trying to say? A man that is completely sold out to the kingdom. Ah. If there's anything I need you to continue to do for me, is to continue to pray for Papa. I can tell you, by June this year, the 5th of June is going to be exactly 20 years of our marriage. And I can tell you that the times I have really sat with my husband, Papa's time is more for the people. How he will bless lives. How he will reach out to people. How we will impart lives. Ah, oh, please help me celebrate this man. Oh. And I also thank God for the patience that God has given to me. Ah. <laughs> eh, eh. I pray God continue to empower me. In the name of Jesus. Sometimes when I need him the most... He will say, you, do you know, I told him, I said, see, do you, have to, do you have to travel on a Sunday? Do you have to travel on a Sunday? At least after Sunday service. Some of you, you will observe that while the service is still going on. Papa is, Papa is just, you know, sometimes he wants to cut some things. It's very short, very brief because he's waiting. They are already telling him, you, you, have, to, you have to travel, you have to leave, you have to catch up with your flight. And all of that. Now, why, why am I saying all this? We have found a father in him, a friend in him, a man that God has given to us in this age and time that is so passionate about the lives of people. Is so, what gives my husband, what gives him joy is to continue to bless lives, continue to reach out to people. 
And I pray that God continue to strengthen you. On this special day, I am wishing you a very, very, very great, beautiful, and a wonderful happy birthday. I love you, Annie. Happy birthday. God bless you, sir.